Hey, what's poppin' guys? Sizzle here, back at it again with the black and white two live decks. Uh, last episode, we got a surprise Excadrill that I really was not expecting at all. Uh, this episode, I don't know, we're gonna go around the caves, see what we got out here. So there are two items out here. Escape rope, that's, that's not useful at all. Uh, and then a smoke ball, that actually can have some use. Not really right now, but... You know, could be, could be useful if I... For some reason, can't afford repels in the future. What is the point of being out here? Like, do they just have a random ledge that lets me look over to this? It's like, oh, I guess it's to show off that there's a hidden item there. Okay, it's kind of random. Let's keep going. I guess this one's going to be a single battle, probably, huh? Ranger Lewis Watchog. Oh, 38. That should be some nice, juicy experience right there. And you know, it's been it's been a minute since we used uh, Dave. So I'm gonna use I'm gonna use Dave this battle. Let's give him some time in the sunlight again. Hyper Fang. Okay. Very nice. Uh, I think I Thunder Wave first. And then I can just hit it with Electro Ball. I should die very fast. I don't think Watchhog is particularly high special defenses. Electro Ball will do increased damage if I'm faster, so you know. Yeah, that's just that just proves the point of the Thunder Wave Electro Ball strat being crazy. I mean, we definitely want Tail Slap uh, over Encore, and we need a coverage move on there as well, but. Rock Blast should be that coverage move, we just don't have it yet. Very nice. Camera up can actually kind of fuck Dave's shit up, but honestly, whatever. I, I don't need, you know, I get revived here anyway. Uh, Dave has done anything he might need to do with friendship. I don't particularly care. Your power should one-shot us, though. Just guaranteed. Camera up's got some decent attacking power, that's like its only stat. An awful defensive, a disgustingly bad defensive typing. Yeah, you know. I think what I do, I could, I could put it fair, I guess, but I don't think I want to. Let's put Max out front. Go with the dig. It has uh, Earth Power, not Earthquake, so we don't have to worry about it. Curse should not have it live a four times effective move from Max. It actually, has some decent attack and power of his own. This thing dies when we get to level 40. Which is very nice. If he doesn't die, I'm kind of shocked. All those will now kill, luckily, but that that is genuinely shocking to me. That curse was enough to have it live uh, four times effective attack. Because it's rock fire, if you didn't know. That's its awful typing. It makes it four times weak to, like, everything. <laughs> Got a lot of weaknesses with rock fire. And not a lot of attacking pair to make up for it. I do not need foul play when I have crunch, which just does wonders on its own. Oh wait, that means we actually evolve now. Huh. Well, Max is gonna be a Krakaruckara. I, I kinda forgot that it evolves at 40. That is gonna be a disgusting Pokemon to have sitting in the back. I do wanna actually train up the rest of my party though now, because Max is a bit over level. Uh, but yeah, there you go. Krakaruckaruck. Crocodile. Never mind, it's not Croc. It was Krakaruck. Now it's Crocodile. Anyway, uh. There's that episode. Hope you guys enjoyed. And uh, I'll see you around in the next one. Bye.